Hi, this is Dexter Panda here, and welcome to my channel. And today I'm on the movies if it behaves itself. So, let's get stuck in. Welcome in. Yes, we're going to learn the basics. or where to place a person or object you're holding. Hovering over a star icon will reveal information about that star. <laughs> Left clicking on a star icon will move your view to that star in your studio lot. To pick up a star, you can left click, hold, and drag them. That's it. Now you know how to use star icons. Drop the star when you're ready to continue. Okay, now let's learn more about information bubbles. Emergency indicators like the one now over your star highlight problems you need to deal with. Hover over your star to view this information. Other useful information will be highlighted with icons, like the one now over your star. 
Hover over your star to view this. Hovering over a person or object will reveal its information. To quickly view all of the information on a person, simply right-click on that person. Try it. Excellent. Now you know how to access information in the world. Okay. Anybody coming in? Welcome to my channel. I'm on the movies today. Okay, let's learn a bit more about moving your view around the studio. Yes, please. You can zoom in and out by scrolling the mouse wheel forwards and backwards. Try this now. Doing it, doing it. Sweet. You can rotate your view around a point by pressing down the middle mouse button, then moving the mouse left and right. Try it. Oh, yeah. Okay, now you know how to zoom and rotate your view. Huh? Great! You now know how to interact with characters and find out information about them. You know about guiding streams and sparkles. And you know how to interact with building floor plans. You now have the skills to begin running your own studio. So get started. Oh. Oh. Okay. Hmm. What should we call? Hmm. Dex does. Hmm. Dexter Studio. Yeah. Dexter Studio. Oh, my name. Dexter Panda. Yeah. Make that plural. Studios. Dexter Studios. Click your studio. Ooh. Uh, that's got a star in it. Hmm. <laughs> the hell? <laughs> uh, a car. Uh, hmm. I go for that. Rainbow, go back there. Yeah, go for that one. There we go. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> Welcome to the dawn of the movie industry. The year is 1920, and your new studio's success lies in your hands. You must guide it to greatness. You must create the biggest movies and employ the most famous stars as you strive to reach the summit of the studio charts and reap the rewards of victory. First, build a thriving studio. Hire wannabes and nurture them into your stars. Make the movies that'll get the big bucks rolling in and clean up at the awards. Then, with every award you win, with every success you enjoy, your studio's reputation will grow. Soon, stars from rival companies will flock to your studio, and you'll unlock new technologies, scenes, and sets to make your movies better than ever. So what are you waiting for? You've got a suitcase full of cash and a world of possibilities before you. Now get out there and start making your dreams come true. Because in the movie industry, Anything is possible. Welcome to your new movie studio. Okay. Wow, it's a big map. Let's 
Sorry, that was me. <laughs> oh no, what have I done? Okay, before you open the studio, you'd better set up some of the essentials. Roger. Ah, oh, what have I done? Right, okay, right, right, right. Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> the first building you'll need is a stage school for hiring your stars. Left click on the sparkling build menu button. Okay, where are we going with this? Hmm. I think right here should be okay. Now click and hold down the left mouse button briefly to pick them up. Now hire them. Follow the sparkling stream. Now click now hire them. Great. Builders perform any fantastic. While the stage school is being built, you can use this time to sort out the rest of the buildings you'll need. Okay, now build a casting office. You'll need this for assigning stars to your movies. Just follow the sparkles on the build menu. Roger. You can rotate a building by holding down the left mouse button and moving the mouse around in a circle. Try this now. Great! Now build a crew facility. Every movie needs a crew to operate the filming equipment. Great, yeah. Love that. You'll also need a set to shoot your movie on. Okay. Stage left click on the sets icon, then select the stage set. Okay. Finally, build a production office. You'll need this to release your movie. Well, it's big. Um Now you've got all the buildings you need for your movie, you can look at improving the studio environment. Okay. One of the keys to running a successful studio is making sure your staff can easily click on the landscaping button, then select the sparkling path icon. Lay a path by left-clicking and dragging out the shape on the ground. Try linking up the flashing connection points on your buildings. Okay, that'll do for now. Remember to lay down more paths as the studio expands. Having a great studio is to make sure your staff have a nice working environment. Try placing down some ornaments. Okay, now place some ornaments around the studio. Left click to place an ornament, and right click to get rid of the one you're holding. 
Try to use a range of different ornaments, as variety is the best way to keep the studio lot looking attractive. Okay, time to move on. Remember to place... Congratulations! The studio is officially open! Hey! Good morning, dear listeners. You are tuned in to KMVS Wireless on a frequency of 1 to 1.5, and I am your wireless announcer, Mr. William McDuck. Thank you for joining me on such a beautiful day. Well, it would appear we have a new movie studio opening in town. So, if you're looking for employment in this fledgling industry, why not take a stroll over to the beach and hand in your resume? <laughs> Remember, unlike the wireless, you don't need a good voice to be in a movie. New actor. Okay. The stars have now started rehearsing the script. This will help boost the final quality of the movie. Okay. Now hire some crew members to manage all the equipment. I think we want some crew. Let's have a look. Oh, let's have a look. Hmm. Hmm. You'll need to hire another crew member for great. Available crew will fill any required crew positions, so you don't need to assign them. Look at the movie to see how rehearsal is progressing. Finished. It's time to shoot <laughs> the movie. Big. Place it in the shoot it room of the casting office. Your movie is now shooting. Go to the stage set to follow its progress. 
Well, the stars and crew you selected will assemble at the set, ready for shooting to begin. Check what everyone is doing by looking at the cast and crew information bubble on the movie. The first scene is now being shot. You can Spike. see the overall movie progress in the movie's information bubbles. Scenes that Action. are still to be shot are displayed in the movie's shooting schedule bubble. Each scene shows which set it will be shot on. Okay, now you can continue to follow the movie's progress. In preparation for your next movie, build the new set that has become available. This will help to keep the public interested in your movies. Cut! It's a wrap! Okay, while the movie is shooting, it's worth looking after the rest of the studio. Look around the studio for information icons and the corresponding tips. It's a wrap. That's cool. Ah, two is free. Okay. That is awesome. Guys, I think I'm gonna leave it there. That's not bad. So, if you liked, um, if you want to see more, then 
appreciate it. Hit the like button. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please feel to do so. Hit the notification bell, then you know when I bring a brand new video out. And have a look at my other um, gameplays. Till then, I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. So, again, bye, guys.